Hi everyone and welcome to my online educational mini-series where I present uh, short, short lessons free on my YouTube channel. Now I'm very passionate about helping people find their unique expression on the harp. Whether their thing is to be a composer or whether they want to learn to sing and write their own songs, whether they want to be interpreters of music from a different, a particular culture, South American music draws them or flamenco or whatever. Everybody's got a very unique calling. If you've been called to the harp, it's for a purpose. Some people want to be healers and work with healing sounds. My passion is to help people find their voice and their thing on the harp. Today's mini lesson is just very simply about a basic improvisation technique. So whatever level you're at, it can get you started on having fun with improvisation. Now, in any Western tonality, whether it's modal or diatonic, diatonic means you've got keys, the major and minor keys, you have an axis point between one and five. Let me show you what I mean. If we're in A major, a little out of tune because I've got some new strings on so do excuse me. Okay the axis point is going to be one which is A to five which is E so A B C D E. So I'm going to play those with my left hand A E A that's the axis. The one to five axis which actually applies across modes and minor keys as well. So you see I put it into A minor. Still I've got the same axis A to E. Or if I keep it without any accidentals whatsoever, what we have then on A is what's called the Iolian mode. So it's one to five. five. If you would like to take your left hand and maybe either two one or three one, whichever is more comfortable for you. Okay. So improvising in the right hand over that, just start once again with one and five, which is once again the A and E. Below the A is G to the A. Now I'm going to use one just below the, the E. G A D E. G A D E. Now I'm going to try adding some notes next to the A and E, but this time above them. about being in time or being too um, complicated just keep this going in the left hand it's just a pattern that continues it gives you a foundation it gives you an anchor and it's very useful when you're first learning improvisation Side 
first notes yet. Even though I went up, I was only going up to the A, which is above the E, so it's still one fives. We find the axis of 1 and 5. If you wanted to start with the, the key of A, Iolian mode, which means all naturals, no sharps or flats, A to A. Find 1 and 5 in your left hand. Just keep a constant rhythm going. And then start to experiment in your right hand. So first of all, just try once again 1 and 5. There's a lot of little ideas you can come up with just with those two notes. Then try adding a note below and above the one and five. So G A D E G A D E above. Improvising. There's much more to come and um, please enjoy. See you later.